Hello everyone, welcome to Halo Moon Tarot. This is your weekly love reading for Leo. Hope you guys are all well. Welcome back to all my subscribers and a big welcome to all the new viewers. See what's going on with you guys. Overall energy surrounding you in love. Overall energy surrounding Leo in their love life. Leo, oh, envy. Ooh, interesting. And we have the thinking man. Ooh. <laughs> Don't see that envy card come out very often. And we have adjacent possibilities. Oh, there's somebody who's thinking about you. Yes, Leo. They are thinking that you may have other possibilities. They're feeling a little jealous. They're trying to get some clarity here. That whether you do or don't, just the thought of you being with someone else drives this person nuts. <laughs> it goes, they go right up to their head, guaranteed. Yes, they think you have other people, other possibilities. Very interesting. Leo. <laughs> what have you guys been up to? Leo, there we go. Oh, yeah, somebody's doing a lot of thinking. They're trying to not think about it too much, right? They're trying not to, but they're jealous. The thought of you being with someone else. Yeah, they think you have other possibilities because you're holding back. <laughs> Leo. Oh, yes, this person gets pretty emotional. They want this new beginning with you, and they think you're probably starting something with someone else. Yeah, Page of Cups. They want to offer you something. Yeah, they. I think they... This person really does. You've been holding back, I think, from this person because you're waiting for a new beginning in love. You're waiting for them to maybe come in and apologize, but I feel like they're thinking you have other offers, okay? Other possibilities, other options. Yeah, they think you have someone else. There we go. Yes. This person's, yeah, they're up in their head here, you know. Again, they're thinking about how to communicate, how to make things right. Uh, they're trying to figure out how to come towards you, okay, to heal a situation. I feel like you do. I actually feel like some of you do have other possibilities. I see a water sign energy. I see earth sign, uh, Gemini, Aries energy. Yes. Yes, I see Aquarius too. Yeah, some of you do. Some of you definitely do have other possibilities. You've been your ships have come in. Some of you've got several offers, Leo. Interesting. Oh, so they're watching you. Yeah, this person's soul searching. They could be a Virgo. Some of you may have a Virgo, Aquarius, Gemini, Gemini, Taurus, Cusp, Aries. <laughs> you got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy yeah so this person is trying to figure out if you're single okay they're watching you they're soul searching doing a lot of thinking i think there's you got two people who think you have someone else because you're holding back okay you're not uh reaching out i feel like you're just trying to clear your energy but the longer you hold back the more emotional they get i do feel like you're you're holding back from one person because i do think you've been waiting for other possibilities i feel like you waited for this person for a long time you were holding on they didn't come towards you so you stopped reaching out you cleared your energy you've kind of healed and now they're feeling jealous they can't stand the thought of you being with someone else envy 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 yeah it's jealousy to me right it's that someone's got that burning desire here not too happy it's very dark very dark energy Four of Swords. Yes, yeah, so there is <laughs> something is coming to a stop. You've been holding back. Okay. Yeah, you're you've held back from somebody. Uh, waiting for things to change or waiting for somebody else. And I do feel like you have another offer. Somebody wants to have a fresh new start with you. Ace of Cups. Leo. Yes. Yeah, there's someone who's holding on to you. They're looking at the details. They figure that you're holding back, making them offers, maybe reaching out to them because you have someone. They're holding on tight, though. They just kind of figure that. <laughs> no matter how they look at this, they're trying to be practical. Yeah, they want to communicate, right? They're thinking about how to communicate, what to say. Soul searching, wondering if you're actually single or if you have other possibilities. Like I said, some of you do 
have a choice between two. Uh, this person thinks you do because you're holding back from them. Mm -hmm. I also feel that uh, some of you are waiting for an apology or waiting for somebody to apologize and start fresh or they're hoping that you will. But the fact that you're not, yeah, they've, this person's definitely, they're trying to find out here that somebody's coming in to speak a truth. Somebody wants success with you. Yeah, there's somebody who wants to have success. They're trying to figure out what's going on. Wow, that's really all this reading's about. Somebody wants to tell you some truth about something. Well, they're trying to find out the truth. This person, it's like an epiphany as well, too, right? Like an aha, that's why they're holding back. They have somebody. Mm-hmm. Yep, there's that love. There's a choice. feel like some of you do. This, you could flip this. It could be you. You might be feeling that way, thinking that somebody is holding back from you because they have someone else. Someone's pondering the idea here of reaching out, trying to think about what to say. Thinking about how to make things right. Thinking if they're right or they're wrong, you know, that kind of thing too. <laughs> Page of Pentacles. Oh, Leos, what have you done? Page of Pentacles, there we go. Yes, so there you got. So this is likely the same person, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, this person, they, they feel sad. They, ooh, they feel sad. Yeah, we got somebody who's got Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in their chart. This person's trying to heal from something. They may have kept secrets in the past or they feel you're keeping secrets because there's mysteries. They're probably trying to watch you on social media to see if you're single. And uh, maybe it actually says you are, but you're holding back. You're not communicating. They're not so sure if they believe that. <laughs> yeah, you got someone here who's missing you, uh, wanting forgiveness. They're... This person's planning something. They're trusting their intuition, I feel, working through something spiritual as well. They want to come in as their higher self, but there's some mysteries and confusion. This person may have kept secrets from you in the past. So now it's funny. This is what happens uh, when somebody um, keeps secrets and you walk away, things end or something, right? Some kind of ending. You stopped communicating. You went into healing mode. You try not to think about this person. Feel like they're trying not to think about you, but they can't help that they don't like the thought of you with someone. But this is someone who kept secrets from you. Okay, there's something that needs to be purged and healed, let go of. This person, you know, may not have held you in high regard. Now that they think about this whole situation, as they try to get clarity here with these crystals, it's like it's flipping around. Now it's like flipping around in their head. Now they think that you have somebody and they can't stand the thought of it. Wow. Like, really, wow. <laughs> Tell me about the star. This person could have Aquarius in their chart. They could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn for some of you. I feel like this person is planning uh, something here. But until they get some clarity, I don't think they'll move the star. I feel like you waited for this person, right? You waited for them. I feel you did. You held on very passionately. You started to look somewhere else because... Uh, they were holding back from you. So you just kind of went, oh, well, what the heck? I'm just going to move on. I do feel like you probably have other possibilities. feel as though you have a lot of abundance. You have a lot going. Yeah, this person's definitely got the king and queen of cups. I feel as though you've got this cancer, Pisces, Scorpio person. Definitely Pisces. Maybe a cancer for some of you. Um they want to purge and heal something. This person's, I feel, is someone who hid their feelings and emotions from you in the past. Uh, they've worked through something, uh, some kind of spiritual energy here where they're, you know, they, they were keeping their feelings hidden, possibly keeping secrets. They may have had somebody else, okay? So now, like I said, it's turned around. Now they think you do because you are not, you're holding back. You're not communicating with them at all. You're, you've just stopped communicating. So now they think you have somebody when in the past they probably did. And that's why you may have ended things. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, so I feel like this person's definitely, they're trying to work this out in their head, trying to figure out, okay, they're trying to get clear if they come back around, how they could get things to go in their favor. 
Okay, they do see you as the Wheel of Fortune. They actually do hold you in high regard, but I feel like they, whatever, I felt like they help hit their feelings and emotions from you. I feel like there's two people, okay, right in the center, and I feel like they hid their feelings, their emotions, uh, kept them secret, it created a lot of confusion. This person need to go within and heal that, all right, to get ready to offer this cup, and I feel like that's what they want to do. It is something you were waiting for, but... Like I said, your ships are here. Somebody else, you know, you got someone else. Some of you may be a Virgo. Uh, you've got other people coming towards you. You have a lot of abundance. You know, there are, you have possibilities. This person's, they, I, I feel like they know you're single, but yet they feel you have somebody else. Like you're working your way towards these other possibilities. They can't stand thinking about it. Yeah, three of wands. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Scorpio energy. Yeah, I feel like this person, um, you may have ended things with somebody because you didn't feel safe and secure. You didn't feel comfortable. Uh, you couldn't see a future. All right. It's like you were sitting here holding on waiting. All right. For this person to come towards you and they didn't. They were too busy soul searching, watching you from a distance kind of a thing. And uh, so it's ended and you've transformed. It's like, yeah, you, you want somebody you're comfortable with. You want somebody uh, that you feel safe and secure with, someone practical. I think you were trying to be realistic. You didn't see a future. Nothing was moving. Nothing was happening. Oh, boy, somebody takes too long. Yeah, there's that uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Yeah, this person's coming up with some kind of a strategy. You know, they want to have this new beginning. They're clear that they want this. They want something solid. They feel like you're getting offers from other people. Yeah, manifesting this. Yeah, so I feel like this person's trying to manifest a new beginning with you. They're, they, they're watching you. They, they, they. There's. Uh, you might even have three people. Oh my God, Leo, Leo, Leo. What are you guys doing? Tell me about the envy. Tell me about this envy. This is the one I want to know. What are they so envious about? Jealousy is the way I see this. What's going on? Yeah, so this, yeah, they'll never admit it. <laughs> they're watching you on social media. They're trying to get some clarity. They may have wanted to, you know, they're trying to get clarity. I think they're, they're looking for answers here. Um, I do feel like the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. In fact, this could be all one person, but it could be as many as three. So because I see Gemini, I, Gemini, I see Virgo, I see Scorpio, I see Cancer, I see Pisces, I see Aquarius. <laughs> Some of you, your ships are here. You have lots of possibilities. You've manifested these, right? Some of you are manifesting it. You have everything you need. You're single and you're ready to go. So you may be seeking out other people. I feel like this person's looking to see if you are, and you definitely are. It's, little, it's almost like too little too late, I feel, as this person has taken too long. Uh, they kept secrets. They held back. I feel you trusted your intuition in the past. This person was holding back from you, so your intuition told you they were moving too slow. They were secretive. Uh, I, I can tell definitely here, Leo, you don't like the confusion, the secrecy. They didn't share their feelings. Yeah, they while well, they're trying to purge and heal that, they want to come forward. This person could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with Aquarius in their chart. Tell me about the adjacent possibilities. What are all your possibilities, Leo? Uh, you're off on a new path. Yeah, putting an end to some burdens that came out first. You're off on a new path towards someone else. You're ready to take a risk. Uh, you may have, this could be somebody else who sees the possibilities with you. They may be coming in to take a risk to have a relationship with you. Taurus energy, Aries energy might be headed. Yeah, ready to take a risk, ready to have a commitment. Mm -hmm. <gasps> yeah, some of you are just letting go of this person, right? And you are off on a new path because you're looking for somebody who's more... Uh, wants to do things in a more traditional manner, commitment, marriage, that kind of thing. I feel as though this person is watching you, keeping an eye on you, feeling kind of jealous that you have somebody new. All right, if you do, or they think you do, 
feel like you're actually single and I think you've manifested other possibilities and you're going to go for it. But someone's coming in to take a risk. They want to come in and take this risk, have this new beginning, but they think you've gone off with someone else. So very interesting. Tell me about the world. we got to dig into this. This is just like the basics. Yeah, tell me about the world for Leo. Why is the world here? Why is the world here? Some of you definitely have choices in love. Some of you are just making a decision. I feel like this person's trying to get clear. They can't stand the thought of, of losing you. Is really, I feel like they're holding on. The world. Somebody was holding back. They were stubborn in the past. You know, maybe too little, too late. Could be. The world there we go ah uh, yes somebody wants to come back around reconciliation they miss you they're holding on yeah i don't know you're holding back trying not to think about them i think they tried to release you and they couldn't they just absolutely could not let go tell me about love the lovers tell me about the lovers tell me about this this person feels that bond and connection, though. Like, they really want this, but I feel like they, you know, this person, they just absolutely didn't, they weren't clear with their intentions in the past. Maybe they feel you're holding back because you're jealous, thinking they have someone. Flip it, however, it could go either way. Yeah, there's that love, yeah. Oops. There you go. Yeah, this person wants a new beginning in love. They want this, a fresh new start. They think that you have. Yeah, they think you've had a new beginning, Leo. They're trying to get some clarity here. Tell me about the King of Cups. I think you got a few. I think you have possibilities. Yep, moving forward. There's somebody who may want to come and see you. Somebody wants to kind of go with the flow here with this water energy, with the swords, thinking that they want to, that you've moved on, that you've healed and purged them. Oh, they, this person's now thinking, you know, they want to heal this. They're ready for love. They're feeling emotionally available, realizing that they love you. They're having this, you know, aha moment. It's like they see you as the one now, but it's almost too late. Yeah, it's like you're, you got tired of waiting. You couldn't see a future. So you put an end to this and sort of changed direction, went off on a new path. And I think you're ready to have a commitment with someone. You probably have someone who's coming towards you, putting an end to anybody or any situation that burdens you, and you're going for it. Yep, you're ready. And you may have somebody with cancer in their chart headed in your direction. Things are going to move very quickly here. Okay, very, very quickly. Somebody's coming in to take control here, to move forward. They're gonna. If somebody comes towards you, they're going to want to go very quickly. Okay, to make sure they secure that deal. Tell me about the Four of Pentacles. A little more clarity. Four of Pentacles with the Ace of Cups. Yeah, someone's holding out. They think, they look at the details. They think that you must have had a new beginning because you've stopped communicating. <laughs> you know, that's what happens when people do that, right? So what it is, is you got somebody who was probably a little deceptive, kept secrets from you, or just... Uh, didn't share their feelings, you know, and it made you feel like they were up to no good. So you just stopped communicating. And uh, I feel this person, the, when they were behaving that way, they kind of moved away from you. And I feel like you just, it's like now they're, whatever it is they were doing, they now think you're doing that, right? That's that kind of thinking. Yeah, so you just don't know, yeah. You just didn't know what this person was up to, I feel. I think that they don't know what to do. They don't know how to go about it. They want to come towards you. They feel like you may reject you or you may reject to them. Okay. They may have rejected you in the past too. And you may have purged and healed this and moved on towards somebody else. I can see this. Tra putting an end to something, tired of waiting, moving towards. You could be moving towards a transitioning towards a Scorpio for that matter. Mm hmm maybe with oh look at that yeah with Aquarius in their chart having a new beginning this person may watch that they may see that somehow you may have some things on your social media about this person or they may see you interacting with them jealousy all right let's see what the outcome is 
get ready because they're going to come back in and make you an offer and they're going to try to rush you to a commitment very quickly they're going to want to come and see you they might drive by your house as well yeah this person's planning something they have a strategy okay this is again someone who's trying to get clear trying to form a strategy how to reach out how to move things forward with you once they make that contact and you connect and they come see you like i said it's going to move very quickly or, or they're going to try to take control and move it quickly yeah they know you have a lot of abundance they know it you have a lot going for you uh, they think you have other possibilities yeah Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Yeah, this person's definitely someone who's been planning something, all right? Planning a return, planning to come and see you, tell you how they feel about you to heal this. They may reach out, be watching you on social media. They may be planning on in, uh, inviting you somewhere, hooking up with you, meeting somewhere out in the community, social distancing. Yeah, <laughs> don't forget. A lot of places you can go out and about, like where I live. We can go to parks. We can go anywhere. Uh, any place that's not roped off is open. You can do whatever you want as long as you stay apart. Unless you live together or whatever, right? That sort of thing. Not everybody's following it here. Most of us are, though. Yeah, so this person's definitely, yeah, they want, they see you as someone is just right. They want to come in and bring the balance back. Uh, I feel like they are somebody that, um, yeah, it's like they want to, they're going to want to, oh, this is marriage. This is somebody who's going to want to move. They're planning on committing to you very quickly, okay? They do not want you to get away uh, because I this holding back, I think, is driving this person crazy. They don't even want to. They can't bear the thought of uh, you being with someone. So they're really trying to, they're up in their head with this strategy, trying to figure out how to make this work, uh, how to move forward. They're ready to put the work in to get things to go in their favor, to keep this wheel of fortune moving. This person could be watching you. If you do you work with this person? Or you may have worked with them in the past. Uh, they know that you're a hard worker. You've got that wheel of fortune energy as well for some of you yeah i feel like this person is going to come in they're going to try and go make things right they want to go about things the right way they know they have to yeah they know they have to hold you in high regard this person has a lot of it they appreciate you they do hold you in high regard they see you as a star they should have done that sooner is what i'm thinking here i can just hear the comments <laughs> Yeah, well, it's okay, Leo, because you got a new beginning with somebody else. You have someone else. You've got two people. Uh, one is new. One is from the past. This person from the past is going to try to come and make peace with you. They don't, do not, don't want you with anyone. So, yeah, I hope it works out, you guys. Uh, they're definitely going to come in and show you, try to show you some kind of appreciation, share their feelings with you. I feel, uh, and I feel like this other person is definitely going to, I feel like they're both going to try to uh, rush you, like manifest this new beginning because they see the possibilities. And uh, you may have manifested this yourself, okay? Yeah, you very well may have. You're definitely off on a new path. You're going to have a new beginning commitment. Uh, this person could be quite traditional. Or actually, they may not even be that traditional. They may run a rush towards the, you know, they're definitely going to try to take control and move things forward quickly. They want success with you. And I feel like some of you definitely have gone off on a new path and you're going to get what you want. That's the way I see it. Okay. And uh, beautiful, really. So you've got you've got choices. You definitely have choices here. If it hasn't happened yet, keep manifesting because whoever this is that you've uh, ended things with and you've held back, you've been trying to heal, and I feel like they are too, but they just can't let go. Uh, it's driving them nuts, okay? Like literally, I can feel this person's energy here. It's like they I think they know they they blew it. They didn't put the work in. They didn't keep that wheel turning, right? And they get it. So the wheels are turning in their head now. So they're frustrated. So yeah, they're coming in to appreciate you. Hold yourself in high regard no matter what you do. Make sure you get what you want. All right. Take control of it that way. 
manifest what you want here. You have everything that you need, okay? So beautiful. All right, Leo, I wish you guys the best with this new beginning. Uh, you, you may even, actually, you might even have two people coming towards you. You may be the one to reach out to one. One may reach out to you. There's definitely a need for some clarity here. Somebody's very clear. They want this. They want this bond, this connection. Uh, there's a lot of chemistry, I feel, between this you and this new person. And uh, it's very, very lovely. So you're going through a transformation. So this is all about feeling safe and secure, looking into the future, putting an end to someone because there is no future with one and going for the new future. So some of you might even have a couple people, like you could have a Virgo. I did see that um, Virgo energy. I, um, they also may have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius in their chart, but I see a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius or a Scorpio with possibly Aquarius or Virgo in their chart. So, wow. All right, you guys, take care, and I will see you next week. Best of luck.